Hi, did you know that there's a gas called nitric oxide that is produced when we breathe through our nose in our paranasal sinuses? Also, did you know that nitric oxide has antiviral and antimicrobial qualities and properties? There has never been a more important time to harness the power of this natural gas that is produced inside our bodies. Welcome to Your Breath YouTube channel. My name is Brian Murphy and I work as a Buteco breathing practitioner. I also have a background in education for nearly 20 years. It's my mission to share with you in practical and informative ways how you can improve your breathing and improve your health in doing so. My focus for today is a gas called nitric oxide. Amazingly, the less volume of air we breathe through our nose, the greater the release of nitric oxide into our bloodstream. It is also really important to note that breathing through your nose is vital for this. It's in the paranasal sinuses that the greatest, greatest production of nitric oxide takes place. This amazing fact of breathing less and having a greater release of nitric oxide was first discovered by a man called Lundberg, a Swedish researcher, and I'll put a link to that research paper in the comment box below. This amazed me when I first learning, started learning this technique because the Buteco breathing technique focuses on training you to breathe primarily and always through your nose as a habit and also to breathe less. Also, in 1998, three men won the Nobel Prize for Medicine and Physiology uh, by discovering the properties of nitric oxide in the human body. One of those properties is that it's a signaling molecule in the cardiovascular system. One of these men was called Ignaro. Because of this discovery, nitric oxide has been one of the most researched gases of the last 20 years. So why is nitric oxide important to you and how do you harness this wonderful gas in your body? Nitric oxide has been administered to COVID-19 patients in some hospitals around the world in recent months. And since the beginning of the COVID-19 pandemic, there has been a lot more focus on nitric oxide. But you can harness nitric oxide by learning to breathe less and breathe through your nose. Less air, less volume through your nose. So the antiviral and the antimicrobial qualities of nitric oxide and properties are really important in today's environment. As I said already, nitric oxide has been one of the most researched gases in the human body of the last 20 years because of that great discovery in 1998. So there is much research out there. But now because of COVID-19, nitric oxide is coming more to people's attention. So if you have any questions about this gas and about how you're breathing and how breathing differently or learning to breathe efficiently can help you harness this gas, please leave a question in the comment box below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and there'll be more information and videos in the weeks and months ahead. Thank you for watching and I hope you learned something from today's video. Bye.